you guys i am just waking up <music> Thank you.
got ready and we're gonna go to Kohl's first and then we're gonna go to Target because I wanna get that e.l.f. foundation. I guess it's called Halo Glow. But I bought this foundation on Amazon. They only had two shades and I thought that this would match but no, it's a little too dark for me. So this one's in the shade Rich Tan C04 from Katkin. I really liked the uh, appearance of the brand's like aesthetic and the cushion foundations, the foundations, blushes and stuff like that. I'll link this brand down below, but yeah, this is a little too dark. So we're gonna go to Kohl's, return this first and then go to Target to pick up that Halo L foundation that is all the hype right now. So let's go ahead and get on the road. It's a little cloudy. Let's head to Kohl's first. The returns are like so easy at Kohl's. The Amazon returns. They're like hassle-free. You don't have to package the item that you purchased on Amazon. And also it's like free returns. So I think that's pretty cool. Yeah, I just wanted to vlog today. It is Saturday. I usually can film on weekends very easily. It's just kind of hard to do vlogging throughout the work week, Monday through Friday, because I do work out of town. I have to drive an hour away, hour back. So I'm gone like 10 hours a day. So it's just kind of hard to run some errands and stuff like this, like I'm doing right now. So regardless, I'm, I'm glad I get to do all this on the weekends because I don't have any work on the weekends. And then if I have a chance, I'll vlog for you guys. So. Alright, so we just pulled up to Kohl's. Alright, so we are here. My Kohl's has the Sephora in it. Okay, so I did pick up a couple of items. I did look. Okay, so if you do uh, Amazon return, every single time that I've, I've done a return, they always give like a $5 coupon no price limit or anything so if you find something that's for five dollars you can get it for free with the five dollar coupon it's like anything except for sephora and maybe name brands but i'm not too too sure but anyways i looked around and look what they had on clearance these were 70 percent off it's the sonoma watermelon spritzer scented candle so i picked this up for 7.99 it smells Oh, it smells so good. It's a three wick candle. So it's it's like the Bath and Body Works candle. Let's go ahead and head to Target. Hopefully they have my shade. And you guys, we are in the same shopping center as Burlington, Bath and Body Works. Marshalls, Hobby Lobby, oh my gosh, but no. I'm tempted, but I'm not going to go to those stores. I need to control myself sometimes. Okay, let's go find that foundation. Yeah, I couldn't find that e.l.f. foundation or they didn't even have any in the e.l.f. like section at Target, but I did pick up some other stuff. So non-related makeup or beauty items. I picked up these little warmer uh, Scentsy things, those little, the wickless candle warmers. And these were $1.40, regular $2. So this is aloe and bergamot for this one. They only had these two scents. And then a lavender white tea. They smell pretty good. And then I picked up this for when I put my hair in ponytails. I like to use this kind of brush. I don't think it's a boar's hair bristle brush. But 
it kind of acts like it so it really sleeks the hair back into a ponytail so i got this from con air it's very pale pink it's real cute and then i got look at these these two little lip smackers isn't that cute oh, i just think that's cute and then what else i got a lot of lippies i went like lippy crazy here let me spread them all out right here so i got uh two of the essence so this one's in the shade what shade is this candy shop so beautiful it has little sparklies in it or sparkles in it and then this one is just a like a clear gloss but it's a summer punch really pretty i think that's a new one too and then i got this profusion let's see this is from the perfect pout line the soft matte lip tint there's that one and then i got this l'oreal one i just the color spoke to me i don't know <laughs> so this one's in the shade 60 sophisticated rose and then this one was a uh, lip lacquer wild rose from elf look how beautiful that shade is right isn't it beautiful so i got all those okay what else did i get i got two makeup palettes so they're from la girl i really love their palettes let me see if i can open these look how beautiful the shades are right and then this one oh wow so this palette is called uh the pro mastery palette and i guess that's just what it's called and then this one is the hey hey vacay eyeshadow palette so beautiful um yeah i do have a couple already from the la girl line and they're so nice but anyways, yeah, so we're going to get ready to go to a football game. So maybe I'll take y'all with us. We are here at the game. You know, let me turn on the lights. Okay, so I just got this in the mail and we're gonna open this together. So basically, basically I have this, I guess they call it a boom arm right here. And then I just put this clamp that I got on Amazon too separately for like maybe $10. And then I just put this from a previous ring light like a portable one and i just clamped it just for extra lighting here but i went ahead and bought a white one that already comes with 
Anyways, you're going to see how we set it up. Look who we have coming in. Hi, King. So, yeah, I bought this one. So, this is the kind that they use. It's an, a magnifying lamp and 24 watt LED lamp light. I love the fact that it had three shade modes. Like it had the natural light, the like the yellowish tint, and then pure bright white. So that's what I liked about this. A lot of other ones don't have the three modes. So let's check it out. I'll link this exact one down below. Yeah, and there's another thing that I loved about this is that it has its own, its own um, like adapter, like actual plug-in. It's not a USB, so I really, really like that. And then it also comes with this right here, which I already have one connected, so I don't need to use this, but it does have one that it comes with. And then look how cool. And I love the fact that it has the on and off switch right here. So, and then it just goes like that. How cool is that? Here's the light. Let's go ahead and let me set it up. I'm gonna take this one out. Let's see. There we go. So you can easily move it around, you know? Let's see the different light modes. There's the yellow one, the daylight, and the bright white. Okay, going dim. So there it is. I like how it has this too, that you can move it. The only downside is that that boom arm is not as long as the other one I had on. That's the only thing. That's the only thing. But it'll swing that way, see? So if I wanna film over there and use the light, I can. So here is like here's no light and then with the light no light with the light so yeah it is pretty bright i like it i like it tell me what y'all think let's turn it off that's it and then if you want to use a magnifying glass it has a magnifying glass i don't know if you were able to see any, <laughs> anything but I like it. I do like it. Okay, let's clean all this. Let me show you what I used this morning. Okay, let me take this out. That way y'all can see a little bit better. Okay, so let me show you what I used this morning for my skincare. So I did use this one. From Bare Minerals, this is the Skin Longevity Long Life Herb Serum. So I used that very expensive, like looking bottle. The product is really nice too. Um, it spreads very easily on the face. It's kind of like a, yeah, like a serum. I did use that. I did use. Usually, I use this for for my neck and my décolleté area. Usually I'll use this for my neck and my decollete, like the chest area. So yeah, this one I'm almost done with. So I'm going to need to buy a new one. Really good. And it kind of gives the face like a luminous look in a way. So that one's good. And then I use this one on my face. So this is the First Aid Beauty 
five in one face cream and it has the SPF 30 just like this one does. 30. So I did use that one. And then I've been using this. This one I picked up, I think at Marshall's maybe. Yeah, I did pick this up at Marshall's. This is a uh, vitamin C and caffeine dark circle brightening eye cream. Look how cute the bottle is. It's simple though. And it looks like that. Does it have a fragrance? No, it doesn't have a fragrance to it. Maybe very slightly, like an orangey kind of fragrance. So it says brightens skin and corrects signs of aging for a smoother, more vibrant eye area look. Yeah, so I've been using that one. And then this I've been using at night to take off my makeup. So, so good. If y'all haven't tried this one, every time I see them at Marshalls or TJ Maxx, I always pick one up. They are kind of a little pricey, but oh my gosh, so good for waterproof makeup. Takes it off just like, like nothing, you know? So you always have to shake it before you use it. So this one I use every morning. I, as you can see, I'm almost done with this one. So this is the Frutia. I get this one on Amazon. I first discovered this at TJ Maxx. Fell in love with it ever since and I recommend it to all my friends and everybody. So, and they get it too. So that one's for the morning, the AM hours. And then I've been using this one for my nighttime toner. So this one is the Lactosica smoothing or soothing toner. So I've been using that one for nighttime and it's really nice. It's kind of milky in a way. I don't know. It, it just, it's really, really nice on the skin and it really makes your skin like real refreshed, very soothing, like it says. So I really, really have been enjoying that. So these I just put here at the bottom. And then this one I got for a, as a pack of three from Amazon. So this is from the Camuse brand. So this is a uh, liquid cheek and blush. So look how beautiful the bottle is, right? So you just unscrew it and then there you go. Let's see. I have real veiny hands, but there it is. It's real pretty. So that I'm gonna keep out because I do wanna use it. I haven't used it yet. So and then I have tweezers here. So I'm gonna put these away. And then I use this this morning. This is the Peripera ink corrector. And this one I use for dark circles and that one's really opaque if you want something to cover look how opaque that is isn't that crazy so yeah it really covers all right you guys so that is it for today and that is it for this vlog so i do hope that you enjoyed watching this let me know if you did like this kind of video i hardly do vlogs but i can do them more often yeah, don't forget to subscribe and see you on the next one bye